All right, in this video, we're gonna show you how to use Trello for your long-term goals. Now, if you haven't watched my orientation video already, click in the description and watch that first, and then come back to this. So it'll show you a lot of basic stuff about Trello. Okay, so to use this for your long-term goals, you're gonna set up a board uh, with, with a list similar to this. So I have, in the future, weekly goals, monthly goals, yearly goals, and goals that I've met. So we're gonna say, I'm gonna make a goal to write a book. I'm going to make a goal to create my financial budget. I'm going to make a goal to lose 10 pounds. I guess that's a good enough goal for now. Okay, so what you're going to do is put these into weekly, monthly, yearly goals. Or, you know, some of these may not even be uh, something that you want to assign right now. So writing a book, this is kind of a long-term thing. Let's make this a yearly goal. Or maybe we even want to have a next year. And we could put that here and say, we're going to write a book between this year and next year. Create a financial budget. We're going to do that this month. Lose 10 pounds. We're going to do that this month too. Maybe we want to get a financial budget done this week. But you can see that, you know, you can take all the goals that you want to do and start, you know, and start setting, setting dates for them, really. One thing that you can do with Trello is you can assign a date. So while this is a weekly goal, we can go in here and say assign a due date and this has got to be done by Friday All right now it says it's got to be done by April 17th and as this approaches the date it's going to turn yellow when it's the day before and really stand out and if it's the day of I think it turns red or maybe it turns green and then it turns red if you've passed the date I believe that's how it works so good little reminders you can put exact dates on these or just kind of keep them out there as vague vague deadlines for your goals but these are certainly good things to have. I wouldn't necessarily use Trello just to keep track of some major goals, but if you're also using it for other things in your life, I think writing your goals down is a good step towards achieving them. So I recommend having a goals for the year board just so you can kind of keep track of some of your major items. Uh, be sure to watch my other videos for some other ideas on how to use Trello as well.